In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for AgNO3 plus SrCl2. This is silver nitrate, this is strontium chloride. First thing we need to do is balance the molecular equation. I can see there are two nitrates here and only one here. So I'm going to put a two in front of the AgNO3. Now the nitrates are balanced, two silver atoms. So let's put a two here, two silvers, those are balanced. Now I have two chlorines, two chlorines strontium and strontium. That's the balanced molecular equation. Now we need to write the states for each substance. If you know your solubility rules, nitrate's very soluble, so we write AQ. It means it'll be aqueous, it'll dissolve in water and dissociate into its ions. Chloride's also very soluble, AQ, with a few exceptions. One exception is silver chloride, one you should memorize. Silver chloride is insoluble in water. When you put it in water, it won't dissolve, it stays a solid, put a little S after that for solid. And then we have another nitrate here, which is gonna be very soluble. So those are the states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into the ions. That'll give us a complete ionic equation. Silver is always one plus, and this entire nitrate ion is always one minus. So I have two silver ions, and I won't write aqueous each time. Let's do that at the end. Plus two nitrate ions. Strontium is in group two. It has a two plus ionic charge when it forms ions. And then chloride right here, Cl minus. So I have Sr two plus, and then I have two of these chloride ions, two Cl minus. Those are the reactants. For the products in net ionic equations, we don't split solids apart. So we're just gonna write two Ag Cl. It'll stay together. And then strontium was two plus nitrate one minus, so I have SR2 plus plus two of those nitrate ions. So this is the complete or total ionic equation. Now we can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of that complete ionic equation. They haven't changed, so we're not really interested in them. I have two nitrate ions in the reactants, two in the products, just cross that out. I have a strontium ion here, strontium ion here, cross it out. But everything else, that's unique. And that makes this the net ionic equation for AgNO3 plus SrCl2. I'll clean it up and write the states and we'll have our net ionic equation. And this is the net ionic equation for silver nitrate plus strontium chloride. You can see our coefficients are two, two, two. We can reduce that down to a lower number. We could just call that one, one, one. We don't write the one, a little more compact net ionic equation. You can see the positive and the negative, they balance out. We have a neutral product, so charge is conserved. And mass is also conserved. We have one silver, one silver, one chlorine, one chlorine. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.